These are the spiders that we have on here. You can't find spiders like this anywhere else. Bro. This thing's kind of heavy. The spiders in here. Why do they need a chain for a spider? Do I just pour it in? Yeah. Oh, bro, I, I don't want it getting out. Can we put something on top? Oh, it's heavy. It's heavy. There's no way it's lifting these rocks, bro. I can barely lift it. What's up guys? Welcome back to a brand new episode of Luxury Dark. Before this episode starts, let's hear a quick word from our sponsor, Point Club. Oh man, I gotta have pennies for breakfast again? Bro, what are you doing? I can't afford cereal, so I'm eating pennies for breakfast. Well, first of all, we have cereal right there. Second of all, if you need money, why don't you just use Point Club? Point Club? What's that? Point Club is a website where you can earn money just by taking surveys, surfing the web, and watching videos. You're basically earning free money just for doing things you already do when you're bored. If you click the first link in the description, you'll get a free $5 after you complete your first survey. Thanks to Point Club, I got a money sandwich. Click the first link in the description to earn a free $5. Make sure to check out our sponsor. Thank you so much, Point Club, for sponsoring. So for today's episode, Chester found this new website on the dark web where you can buy exotic pets. He's been super excited to check this site out, and I've been reluctant about it because of what happened last time. <laughs> oh, dude. Yo. Bro, what is this? Did it break through the window? Dude, I think it broke straight through here. So we're just hoping that this time that things go a little more smoothly. All right, let's sit down and check out this site. Okay, let's uh, sit down and check out this exotic pet site. Okay, so this is the website selling the animals. Dude, let's go to the worm section. Can, can you calm down? Can we just look and see what's on here first? Okay, let's look at the worms. Okay, so on this section, it looks like we have a goliath bullworm. Looks we could put that in the bathtub and fill it with dirt. Okay, I mean, let's look at the other worms first. Okay, wait wait one second here, because it looks like there's also a spider section on this site. Now, I think having a spider would be a lot cooler and a lot classier than having a pet worm, don't you think? Uh, no. Let's go... No. Bro, if you want to get an animal off this site, why can't we get something that we're both going to enjoy? Dude, let's go back to the worms. Why do you want to go back to the worms? Let's go, let's go to the spider section, come on. Okay, and the description here says, these spiders will crawl inside your heart and nest, giving you a feeling of warmth and paralyzation that money cannot buy. Okay. Oh, dude, that doesn't sound right. Okay, let's look at the spiders on here. Okay, so these are the spiders that we have on here. We have the skinny spider, the pig-eating spider, oh. the pale-faced spider, and the black goliath spider. Bro, let's go back to the worms. The Dude, are you afraid of spiders or something? No, it's just they're not as cool. I mean, you can find worms outside easily, bro. You can't find spiders like this anywhere else. Let's check out the black goliath spider right now, okay? Oh. So it says on here that the black goliath spider is their largest spider. This is a pregnant female ready to lay eggs. Keep away from small children, the elderly, and pets. Okay, I mean, this thing sounds kind of terrifying to me. Yeah, dude, then let's go back to the worms. Dude, I don't know why you want a worm from this site so badly. You already have worms. It's a worm farm. It's not the same thing. Many hobbyists... You can call them whatever you want, bro. You have worms, though. Let's just get the spider, all right? Okay, guys, so we just ordered the spider. Apparently, this thing weighs almost 20 pounds, which is very surprising to me because it doesn't look that big in the picture. Uh, I don't know when exactly this thing is going to be delivered, but it says within the next few days, and we're going to get text notifications for when it's going to arrive. Dude, this spider better not touch me or I'm going to freak out. Well, you just said that you weren't afraid of spiders, so I don't know why that would be a problem if it wanted to touch you. Yeah, I'm not afraid. I just don't want its hairy arms on me. It really sounds like you're afraid, bro. I guess we'll see when it comes in, right? All right, let's uh, let's conclude this. Okay. Yo, dude, I just got a message that the package arrived. Okay, let's uh, go check the door. Let's open the door. There it is. 
Should we bring it inside? I don't know, dude. It's got a chain on here. All right, uh, so I guess it Bro. thing's kind of heavy. The spider's in here. Why do they need a chain for a spider? In case it breaks out of the box. All right, so you want to open this thing up right now, or do you want to open it up upstairs? Uh, I guess let's go upstairs. All right, I guess uh, let's take this thing up. Bro, did you see that? Bro, how strong is this thing? Dude, the box just moved. Now I can see why they put the chain on there. Oh, I don't know. Okay, uh, uh, let's, uh, uh, let's take this thing upstairs. Oh, uh, dude, I don't want to touch it. Let's get a look at this thing, okay? Carefully. This thing's not venomous, is it? I don't know. You hear it? It's scratching on the box. You think it could get out? Well, it didn't get out yet. Let's just take it upstairs. Come on. Okay. Careful with it. Okay. So, we got the box right here. We're going to try to open this thing up and uh, get the spider out of here. Do you have any idea how we're going to remove this chain? Do you have like bolt cutters or something? Okay, I got nail clippers. Okay, why do you have nail clippers? Because it has a file on it, bro. Bro, the nail clippers aren't going to remove this chain. This chain is made out of steel. Okay, how about we just try sliding the chain off of the box? Like this. Can you slide that side off? Okay. Alright, alright. We got that off. We got it off. Alright, let's just cut this thing open with a pen. You got this? Oh, bro, this box has a certain smell to it. Dude, I don't like this thing. Okay, wait. I think we're about to see the spider. There's another box in here, bro. What? Alright, so this is the other box in here. It says, notice biohazard level 2. This is um, 11, dude. Dude, this is Roman numerals. Roman what? Alright, let's just take this box out of here. I think the spider's in this thing here. Oh, dude, I can hear it scratching. Let's put this down. Dude, wait, there's like a pirate symbol over here. What? What are you talking about? Never mind. Alright, let's just, uh, let's open this thing up, right? Okay. Oh, bro. Is that webs? Oh. Alright, bro. This is that is, it down there? Yeah, that's a spider down there. <laughs> I am mean, a little bit more creeped out than this thing that I thought I would be. Do you want to, like, take out the webs and, like, look at this thing more? Oh, what is it doing down there? Alright, do you want to just put the lid back on this thing and put it in the tank that we have in the garage? Dude, get this thing away from me, bro. Alright, let's just put this thing in the garage. Okay, come on. Alright, so let's put this spider in this tank here. Oh, dude. Keep that away from me. Alright, so we got this thing on top of here. Do I just pour it in? Yeah. Oh. Bro, I, I don't want it getting out. Can we put something on top? Yeah, well, what do you got? You got some, some bricks or rocks or something? Yeah, let's just stack some stuff on top. Okay, so we found these rocks outside. Oh, it's, it's a heavy one. I mean, there's no way it's lifting these rocks, bro. I can barely lift that. Okay, so we got this camera going. Let's just see how this thing behaves at night when we watch the footage in the morning. Bro, this thing is really creeping me out. Right. It's staring at you. It's not staring at me, bro. It's curious. Okay, can we go inside now? It's cold in here. Okay.
right guys, so it's almost 4 a.m. right now. I just heard a very large crash coming from downstairs, so I'm gonna go check it out. Hello? Someone here? I'm gonna go check on that spider. Yo, what? Okay guys, so I'm about 90% sure right now that uh, this spider got out. I gotta go tell Chester, although I'm really not trying to alarm him. <sighs> Chester? <sighs> Chester? Chester? <clears throat> Chester? <clears throat> Bro, I think I'm done it. Yo, what's in your mouth, dude? What's in your mouth? Oh, oh, dude. Yo, go wash your mouth. Get up. Get up. Go wash your mouth. Why'd you let it out of the tank? I didn't let it out. I swear to God, bro, it escaped. I did not let it out. Wash your mouth. Dude, what is that stuff? Oh. Okay guys, so it's the next night right now. Uh, we're trying to see exactly how this thing even ended up breaking out of that tank. So let's look at the footage we have here. Bro, it's squirming around like crazy. Yeah, it probably didn't like being in there. We should have given it some water or something. Maybe it was thirsty. Bro, we're lucky this thing didn't eat the cat. Yo, dude, look at that. What's it trying to do? Bro, it just broke through. Yeah, I know, dude. We know it broke through. I can't believe it lifted that up. Dude, I hate to say this, but I have to see what that thing did in your room. Oh, dude. I don't know. Let's see. Dude, what's it doing so close to my face? Uh, I don't know, bro. It's definitely doing something with your mouth. You normally sleep with your mouth open? Dude, do you think it was laying eggs in me? Dude, I have no idea what it was doing to you. Okay, I mean, I, I think we saw enough, right? You mind if I shut this computer? Bro, I, I feel like I can feel them in me. You can feel the A's in you? Dude, come on, bro. Dude, I feel something crawling around. Dude, you're being hypochondriac right now. I mean, do you want me to take you to the doctor's office or something? Dude, I need to get like an ultrasound or something. An ultrasound? You think you're pregnant with this one? Dude, this is a joke! Bro, as soon as the eggs hit your stomach ass, they probably dissolved. And that's if there were eggs. We don't then know. Then why was it eggs. near my mouth? I don't know, bro. It probably just was warm or something. Probably felt good for it to put its tail in there. Dude, you think way too much about this, okay? Let's 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 go, alright? Let's let's cut this video. Thank you guys for watching this episode. Realistically, this actually turned out horrible for us, and I'm not sure if we're gonna be buying pets on the dark web again. I looked at Chester's stomach, and it does not look like he's pregnant with spiders. We're unsure what this spider was doing in Chester's mouth, but he wants to go to the doctor, so that's where we're headed next. Anyways, remember, let's hit 75,000 likes for the next Luxury Dark episode to be released, and thank you guys so much for all of your support. We wanna show you guys a little bit of footage from our other channel, Life of Luxury. Click the link in the description to watch the full video and subscribe to Life of Luxury. Hope you guys enjoyed that footage. Remember, let's hit 75,000 likes on this episode for the next Luxury Dark episode to be released. And thank you all for watching, and we'll see you next time on Luxury Dark.